Yo, what's going on guys, Anders here today with another video. If you are a content creator, live streamer or video producer, then you probably know how important it is to have a safe place to store your files. Today's video is just made to you, ladies and gentlemen. I present you the ASUS Store AS530014 NAS, also known as the Nimbus Store 4. Now, without further ado, let's get started. Ever since we started producing 4K videos for Fury Pixel, our main storage has been running out of space quite fast since each product takes up between 25GB to 100GB and up. So we decided to upgrade our storage, finding a way to protect our files while being able to share them easily with our team. Here is where the ASUS Store Min Booster 4 comes to the rescue. For those who don't know what is a NAS, it stands for Network Attached Storage which is basically an internal network that can be accessed by multiple people at the same time or it can be accessed from anywhere using a browser or even a mobile app. Think of it as your personal cloud, except with a NAS you have complete control over the users and the storage capacities, all without monthly fees or companies overseeing your personal data. This NAS features an Intel Celeron 1.4 Qualcomm CPU that can be boosted up to 2.5 GHz. Two 2.5 GB Ethernet ports with up to 5 GB that can get its speeds up to 564 MB per second read and 551 MB per second write using a link aggregation and optimized network settings. Up to 56 TB of storage capacity, 4 GB of RAM DDR4 expandable to 8 GB which is 30% faster than the RAM DDR3 that most NASes use and this NAS has a 3 years warranty. Now let's take a look at what's inside the box. Of course we have the ASUS Store NIM Booster 4 unit, an AC power cord with its AC power adapter, two LAN cables category 5E and some flat screws. At first glance one of the things stood out to me right away is that this NAS doesn't have the typical cube shape that you see with most NASes. The front of the NAS has a magnetic glossy panel that hides the four dry bays, along with the power button, the NAS status LED indicators, a one-touch copy button, and one USB 3.2 port. On the rear we have two USB 3.2 ports, one HDMI that supports 4K resolution, two 2.5 GB Ethernet ports, and of course ventilation is very important so there is also a 12 cm fan. Actually, this NAS is pretty quiet, running at only 32 decibels at max performance. So we set the NAS in RAID 5 configuration, which allows you to duplicate and create backups of your data. In addition, parity is also spread across all the drives, so in case one of the drives were to fail, you will still have all your data. For the drives, we will be using four 14 terabytes Iron Wolf hard drives from Seagate. These hard drives were specifically built for NAS devices and RAID applications that can handle high workload rates in high-end traffic networks. These NAS hard drives are enhanced with Eagle Array technology for optimal reliability and system scalability. On top of that, they feature rotation vibration sensors, 7200 spindle speed, 256 MB of cache. They come in storage capabilities running from 1TB up to 16TB. And my favorite feature is that they support Iron Wolf Health, which is a software that allows you to monitor the status of each of the drives on your NAS. Installing the drives to your NAS is very simple. First off, you need to remove the drive base slots. Then you need to remove the side brackets of the base slot. Align the hard drive on the base slot, then secure them with the brackets, place the drives back into the NAS and bang! Now you're ready to set up your NAS by following the steps on the quick installation guide. For us, it took us around 40 minutes to set up RAID 5 with 56 terabytes. Now, this NAS comes with one of the coolest interface in terms of design that I ever seen on a NAS. With a gaming theme that makes you feel like this is a NAS made specifically for gamers. Now, you may be wondering, what can I do with this NAS other than using it as my ball to store all my files? Well, there are actually a lot of other things that you can do. First off, you can manage all your storage create several users and allocate a certain amount of storage space for each user. You can install different types of apps like Plex, which is an app that allows you to stream your 4K videos by using your computer, laptop or even your smartphone. It has apps that allows you to monitor security cameras, even install some games and more. 
You can actually connect a 4K monitor along with a mouse and keyboard directly to the Nimbus Tor 4 and you will be able to operate directly from the NAS. There are a lot more cool things that you can do with a NAS that unfortunately we won't be able to cover in a single video. Anyways, overall I'm very excited to finally have a device where can I save all my projects and know that they are going to be safe and I will be able to access them no matter where I am. I also love the fact that I can assign dedicated space to my team members so that we can all work remotely from one central point. And that's all for today's video my friends, let us know in the comments below what do you think about the Asus Store Nimbus Store 4. If you like the video don't forget to give that thumbs up, share, subscribe and smash the notifications bell on that way you won't miss any of our future videos and content. This is Sanders, see you next time.